Hey guys, it's Ken from KPD Productions TV. Welcome back to another Kendomic food review just for you. I am in the very pretty city of Anaheim, California, right across the street from Disneyland at an IHOP, or should I say IHOB, I've seen a lot of people do the new burgers at IHOP and uh, I had IHOP breakfast when I first came here and I noticed the burgers but I, I also noticed that Adam the Woo and uh, Matt, uh, Zion from Reckless Eating and Dame Drops, everybody's done this burger. Uh, I'm not sure which burgers they did off the top of my head but uh, I thought I'd try the jalapeno burger and so I zipped in there, grabbed one. And of course, it got bumped on the way out, so it's probably all over the place. Uh, the burger and a drink, <laughs> that's a crazy big drink. <sighs> I did uh, Pepsi, the only sort of Pepsi here. Came to 15, oh, uh, sorry, 1507 United States of America currency. All right, so they did put a toothpick in there but uh, it seems to have fallen over anyway. It didn't do its job. The bun is very uh, greasy. I'm not sure why the top of a bun would be greasy. Uh, she gave me a bag with like a ton of ketchups. And I'm like, yeah, I don't need all those ketchups. So I gave them all back to her. I don't want more ketchup on my burger. And a spoon. I don't know. Why do you need a spoon? All right, so let's open up this little package. Don't need the knife, don't need the fork, but I'll definitely need this. It's funny when, when you do takeout at McDonald's or any of the other places, you will uh, often grab a lot of napkins, but when you're doing a takeout at a sit-down kind of restaurant, they only give you one. Let's see if we can take this out. It looks pretty good. It smells great. Oh, look at that, people. Check it out. Scratch it. <laughs> Sniff it. The rest will probably be mine. I'm going to move this tray because I don't mind if I drip on the other tray. Actually, I'll use this tray, the, t the lid. Wow, that looks good. It kept, it kept its cool, even though it's all sliding out the back end. Ooh la la. All right, guys, let's go straight in for a bite of the jalapeno burger. Mm. Not bad. Mmm, salty. Mmm. Oh, the jalapeno's kicking in. Woo! That's a good burger. Mmm. It's not like you're. It's not a super juicy patty. I'm not sure if they hand make these. I like how they put the lettuce on the bottom, very nice. There is a pickle in there, I'm gonna eat it anyway. They look like hand pressed patties. Let me know in the comments below if they are or are they not. But they look like it. Mm hmm. Apparently, Whoa, did I get it on me? Well, the bottom of my napkin is wet because I had it up against my drink, which is condensating like crazy. I heard it was going to be a limited time uh, offer. I don't know why you'd want to limit uh, that, uh, IHOP. Because if I wanted a burger and I was at IHOP, I'd order that again. 100%. The bun's nice. It's like, um, kind of like an egg bread kind of bun because it's a little bit yellow. Hmm. Let me know in the comments below if you've had an IHOP burger and did you try the jalapeno one because I'm loving this thing. Hmm. As you can see, I'm not stopping eating it. Hmm. There's not one thing wrong with that burger. When I first bit it, 
seemed very salty, I'm not sure why. And I kind of hate to say this, but I think I'm starting to like pickles on my burgers because of you guys during my live shows making me eat pickles. I knew over time I would get to like it and it tastes good on this one and I'm guessing the jalapenos, the just the whole combination of all the ingredients in this burger is making it uh, very uh, delectable and I want to keep eating it. So I like to do a one o'clock in the morning shout out bite to all the IHOP people out there who have been loyal to the IHOP brand, whether it's breakfast or lunch burgers. And uh, this bite is for all you guys who watch my videos at one o'clock in the morning. Here we go. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, right, good. Very nice. All right, guys, I am starving as usual. I'm gonna polish the rest of this off and I'll be right back. Hang on. Well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Two points for Ken. Did it go in? Yes, it did. Uh, excuse me. It was that good. All right, ladies and gentlemen, on my rating scale, I'm going to give IHOP or IHOB on my rating scale for the jalapeno burger a go and get it now. It was really good. There was nothing wrong with it. I was kind of surprised. I thought, uh, I don't know, they were going to use like a frozen patty and it was just going to be like, and eh, let's just put burgers on the menu. But that was a really good burger. It was a very uh, nice backyard barbecue style burger. The jalapenos definitely gave it a really good kick to it. Uh, the pickles on this burger worked really, really well. I wouldn't put pickles on every kind of burger, but uh, on this burger, I recommend it highly from me to you all right ladies and gentlemen if you enjoy watching these videos of me in california in a mustang convertible and you don't want to miss the next one hit the subscribe button it is somewhere on the page probably right around here click the notification bell so you don't miss the next one but if you want to show your support for these videos please always always Hit it with a thumbs up, ding, 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 and we'll see you next time on another Ken Donald Food Review. Ken Donald out. Boop.